In this video, I will be talking about the Posture Warrior 2 in yoga. I will be demonstrating proper alignment and then misalignment and what are the cues to pay attention to as we are moving through this posture. So we'll be utilizing this a lot during our program, so it's important we understand the proper stance and the misalignments that are common so we can stand up in this posture, um, engaging the appropriate muscles and making sure we're working as completely and fully as we can in an aligned way so we keep safe. So first things first, let's take the legs wide. If you point the hands directly downwards, that is about where your feet should be. Your toes align with the edges of your feet. From here, let's turn the right toes out to the right, bending in the knee. And then the arms are reaching out to the sides. All right, let's focus first on the lower body. So with that front knee, notice if the knee is slightly caved inwards so that they're to the left of the toes and then bring that knee back by pressing the knee into the hand, the hand being on the outer edge of the knee, and then bringing the hand on the inside of the knee, pressing in without letting that knee move in inward. Good. On the outer edge of the leg, you're pressing through the outer edge of the foot, and the foot is at a slight angle inward, not too much, but just like two centimeters inward. So heels just a tiny bit uh, more out than the toes. Good. Now let's move to the rib cage. So if you look down, you'll notice that your hips are slightly shifted to the side. It's pretty um, anatomically difficult to bring our hips directly straight, but we're working on that. But for the ribs, we'll shift the ribs so there's a slight rotation facing forward while the hips are at a slight angle. And then we'll reach the arms out, reaching out with the fingertips. <sighs> nice, relaxing in the shoulders. So a common thing I see is holding the shoulders, relax the shoulders down the back, reaching out through those fingertips. And if you do this in front of a mirror, check your rib cage and make sure you're not coming forward or coming back, but you're directly head, shoulders, tailbone in line, right directly down. Good, and then let's switch sides. Taking the toes out to the left, bending in that knee. Back foot heel is slightly tilted out, just a little bit more than the toes. Good, checking in that front knee, pressing on the inside and the outside just to create torque and stability in that front leg. And then rotating the rib cage slightly so that it's faced forward. And then from here, we'll reach the arms on out, relaxing the shoulders, and eventually looking over to that uh, front middle finger. Good. And coming back to center. Nicely done. So we'll be practicing warrior two a lot. This pose is an amazing posture for 